Hi, welcome back. Why I have to do part two because I got power interruption in the middle. So like I need to forcibly continue as a part two. Otherwise, I would have explained in the previous video only. So what we are discussing VF twenty one. Okay, we have created a couple of NYSs. Let's try to check this. Let's uh, see sixteen n whatever the NYSs we got created. Or else let me check. <laughs> if i can able to get in drop down same thing oh i am not able to get it it sends with 26 and 27 so let's go to sc 16n okay vbrk so then uh, let's try to put it here f2 and the sales or gis jdh 01 let's try to Give the today's billing date probably today or tomorrow. Okay, let's try to create. Okay, so these are the two invoices I have created for invoice list. Let's copy this. So we'll continue our discussion from here. We have twenty one. Okay, let's copy this. So let's try to consolidate. Uh, so it's giving a log. Let me check what is the log is all about. So currently being processed, this still showing. So somewhere it might be locked. Let's go to SM12 and let's click the list. Okay. So suddenly happened right. So it is locked by myself. Let's remove this. Okay. Now I can able to create it. VF21. So let's try to execute the invoice list. Okay, if you see this net value is twelve hundred. Let's try to compare. This this is how we can learn twelve hundred. So so let's come here here the invoice total. Okay, let me put it invoice net total. Total is twelve hundred. Okay, so let's come here. So what is the tax all about? Is two twenty eight. Uh, put together all invoice. Two twenty eight is this one is your MWST. Okay, so factoring discount we haven't created. Okay. This at the rate one person will create it, and uh, haven't done any pricing changes. That's why we required hundred percent this session. So so this is twelve hundred, okay, and two twenty eight. So let's go to SC sixteen n. Okay, so let's go to uh, like uh, VBRK, VBRK. And what are all the invoices we have created? This one, and let's give today's billing date. Okay, so so like uh, document type is F two, no problem. So this is what we are getting in. Okay, here somewhere you can able to see the total of the net. Okay, so this I have already explained you. So the net is. Twelve hundred. Okay, so for this taxes, this one. Uh, let's try to sum up this. Okay, so twelve hundred is this one, and let's go further. Two twenty is tax. Okay, that is, that it is got matching now. Okay, so additionally. For paying this one, one percent factoring discount I am giving now for these two invoices. For that configuration, let me show you. Okay, v slash zero eight. Okay, what is my pricing procedure? Okay, G Honda. That's what I have created. Let's come here. So before MWST, I can able to add this one. Probably I can take the this one as. Uh, Uh, what I would say, six hundred is RL zero zero. So what it talks about the twenty three? That means it has 
this condition type has to be shown in invoice and a base to be calculated and it is a statistical condition so the requirement is what is this i have to show the base type is 2 basically this is a discount in real time you can able to create it uh, your own account key if you really want it i'm saving this one okay one by one i'll show you come back okay so now we added a factoring discount so let's try to come back let me share uh, so let me try to open one more session more sessions on mobile might may hiccup issue okay that's okay we'll give it a try and um, here let me do it again vf21 okay you will not get automatically you have to maintain the condition record that's what i would like to show you okay so no discount applied you can see this the conditions if you look at this nothing is there so now let's try to create a new one otherwise we will try to check vk11 okay this one is rl00 okay so that has 0 1 and h1 and hh H is the division let me try to take the customer in hands with six our france customer okay let me try to take uh, the factoring discount i'm just giving it as a one percent okay so let's save this now let's check if it if it won't apply there is no surprise because the invoices already got created so let's try to check how the system behaves okay it's not applied so let's try to create v uh, vf02 let's check if any chance is there control v okay this is 26 i feel this is the invoice i think we have created today and let's try to go to the item level and let's try to trigger okay accounting posted then i cannot able to do this one okay let me check in header if any chance is there i don't think so conditions okay let's replicate the same with uh, why we need to cancel and all those things uh, to apply the factoring discount okay anyhow on factoring discount i would like to add one more thing tax on factoring discount okay so this is 600 there is one more condition type called 601 okay mw15 here it talks about it is statistically again you have to take the requirement 21 okay requirement 21 and this is statistical so basically these two condition types are required factoring discount on the tax it is required for my invoice list so it's natural okay so and the step number should be here from should be 600 on what you supposed to calculate it on factoring discount what is calculated on that one percent you supposed to calculate this one okay let me check okay this one rl00 statistical and this routines you have to remember in standard okay if required i have to have copy and you have to do it let's do this i'll show you another couple of invoices maybe i put it in v1 so let's do it so now it is 400 is the net value go to the conditions know where you don't have rl00 and other stuff okay nws let's save this so the routine number 23 stops actually vl01n the center so let's check take the storage location and do the pca 
okay v of 0 1 so invoice got created for 400 let's try to create one more invoice for observation because it is consolidation right so it's 28 so before that let me show you one thing so it is it will be appear as a statistical condition you can able to see this rl00 you can see this rl00 mw15 at invoice level but not at sales order level year 01 I'm just replicating the same scenario. So 400. So let me take one one more so that you know it matches with our net value. Save this. Again, VL01N. Press enter. If power interruption happened, I need to do one more part. By God grace, if it supports on my mobile, that's fine. So 800 will be your net value. Okay, let's save this. So now let's go here. So let's try to get into here. So this, I'm copying this one as my invoice. This one is, uh, so 27, we use 28. So this one is 29, okay. Now the same story we have replicated. So if you would like to see, you can able to see the net value. Okay, 1200. Uh, let's try to move a little further here. And let's try to check the tax. This also, I'll total it. This is how you have to learn everything with observation. Otherwise difficult to survive in real time. Okay, you got you got what you want it. So in Excel also we mentioned the same thing. So now let's see the factoring discount, how it is applied in our VF21. So now let's come here slash and VF21. So 29. And let's copy this 28. Okay. Now let's check this. Now see this. So it is got applied 12. Okay. So you have taken. Uh, so on your net value, one percentage is 12. Okay. Again on this one percentage is two. Okay. Let's see the Excel the same values. So equal to this into one divided by 100 you got 12 okay mwas mwas tax on fact this okay let's put it this way so equal to into one divided by 100 Okay, on total, uh, so it is what, uh, so this is two, okay, 2.28 it came. Am I calculated wrongly? That this should be calculated this into one divided by 100. So somehow it is coming. So whatever it may be the case, it is uh, 2.28. Okay. 
so it came let's try to check the percentage let's go to the conditions oh it is 19 percentage mws uh, is equal to mwst by default it will take okay i forgotten to tell you okay so this one should be 19 percentage so let's put here one more nine so that uh, we can reach our target already. okay so this is how you have to check what i would say your factoring discount okay now see actually it's supposed to be payable 1428 so this 12 plus 2 another 14 it is got discounted the final value arrives like this okay output let's come to check output vv31 so lr000 okay let me maintain the customer same thing it will create an output actually so we have taken this french customer then that's fine let's take the medium is print old and let's put it en uh, so let's try to maintain this one as local and print out one on save it will come so by default it is taking background job let me put it as a save now go to again vf21 i don't want to save this but i will show you how it works so you can give the document type if you want it or else it's up to you okay this is what it is calculated you can able to see this this is what the output is all about okay thank you so this is if you save this output will be generated okay thank you thanks for joining the session wishing all the best have a great day Further to tell you, okay, if you are not yet uh, subscribed, please subscribe my channel to get more inputs like this. You will have a lot of learning. It's a beautiful journey. Currently, I'm holding 6,000 plus students with 1,000 plus reviews. And this is one of my top posts. I'm just trying to add this video also over there. And this is for my, what I would say, uh, this two courses specifically created to give a lot of knowledge for real time. So, because outside consultants also, once they are getting into real time deceiving a lot of students, I don't want to get that chance. Whoever subscribed my channel and they would like to subscribe my courses, this is for IDOC's five scenarios I have explained. And this is for um, IDOC, oh, sorry, this is for functional specification, getting master to write functional. So this is, these two are very important for your work. Uh, live about your interviews of course interviews also it will be useful these two courses for pricing if you really wanted to learn business process i have a couple of courses this is for s4 ana this is specifically for ucc you can able to give a try and this is one specific course you must do it before getting into the real time so after 2027 so you have to learn s4 hana system and we don't have much changes but in that few changes, this is one of the specific change. Three scenarios I have explained. You can give a try all these things if you really want it. Stay tuned with my channel. Thank you so much. Wishing you all the best. Have a great day. Jai Bharat. Love you all.